Hey everyone, it's Melissa. Today I'm just going to do a quick video of something that just occurred to me. Uh, it's Saturday, I'm getting ready to go to the grocery to get ready for the Super Bowl tomorrow. And as you can probably guess from my accent and how fairly close I am to Atlanta, it kind of gives you an idea who I'm yelling for tomorrow. So, so today I'm going to talk about Pippa Middleton and my tennis elbow. Uh, I wanted to title this Pippa Middleton cured my tennis elbow, but I thought that might be a little bit deceiving. Now, obviously, I do not know Pippa Middleton, and obviously, Pippa Middleton has not done physical therapy on my elbow. But what I have done is I have been influenced by a, the Pippa Middleton name to buy something that has helped. Today, something just kind of clicked and occurred to me, so I thought I would share it. Uh, over the past year, maybe two years, I have just really suffered from tennis elbow. I just, I, I have gone to uh, physical therapy. I've had uh, thera therapeutic massage on it. I've had several steroid shots. I've had, I've gone twice to an orthopedic, to an orthopedic surgeon. They've done MR. They've done MRIs on me, MRIs or CAT scans, I get them mixed up. X-rays on me, just all kinds of stuff. And, and so, you know, I thought, why is this some, suddenly happening to me? So let me go back. When I first started YouTube and, and even before, I had already done a review on a purse. And it was the Pippa purse. It was, uh, you know, I, I saw Pippa Middleton and she was always carrying this purse and I just thought it was so cute. It looked so cute on her. So I did some research and I found out that it was made, that a company named this purse after her because she had carried it so much. It was uh, Motorloo, I think is how you pronounce it. I looked it up on their website, M-O-D-A-L-U, Motorloo. So, uh, you know, I talked to Doug about it. I said, you know, I'd really like to have this purse. Uh, I know it's, you know, it's a, it's a real nice purse and more than what I usually, but, but it's, I liked about it because it had so much organization to it. So he said, okay. So uh, I got interested, you know, I started watching YouTube and I got interested in other purses that people were demonstrating. Uh, not the you know really really high end, but uh, but but very nice ones, nicer ones than I had ever you know carried before. So I, I tried a couple. I got I would you know occasions like for Christmas, you know just uh, really was such a treat for me, and um, just I was so appreciative. So when I got that the first purse, that's when the tennis elbow started, and so I just you know suffered and suffered and. I mean, I just took, I tried creams, I, I tried braces, I, I taped it by uh, kinesiology tape. I just did everything, and I had shared a lot of it on here on YouTube. Uh, and just nothing, <coughs> excuse me, nothing would really help. It just stayed irritated. And sometimes it would just get so painful that I would just have to, every four hours, take, take two Advil every four hours to even be able to, space, to stand the pain. Uh, it would hurt even when I wasn't moving it. So, uh, this past Christmas, right before Christmas, I talked to Doug again. I said, I know we've bought these purses, and I know we've spent money on them, but if I sell them, if I maybe sell them on eBay or something, if I sell them, would you consider for Christmas going back and getting me a Pippa again, a Pippa purse? I never had any problems when I was carrying that purse. So he said, okay, and I thought, well, I missed all the organization that it had in it anyway because everything just was exactly where, you know, it has so many zippers and so many compartments and it just organized so beautifully. So uh, he said, okay, that he would, and so he did. He got me that for Christmas. So I immediately took everything out of my purse and put it in here. And I noticed in this past two weeks, at least two weeks, maybe even three weeks, my elbow doesn't hurt at all. 
I can do everything. I can do this. I can do my weights. You know, I can move everything around. I can just anything that I could never be before, do before. And the only thing that's changed is carrying this purse. And it might not seem it would make a difference because I still carry the same amount of things in it, which is a lot of things. I carry my makeup and, you know, everything that, that, that we need or I feel like I need to get through my day. And uh, so the weight hasn't changed. The only thing I can figure out is that this is just so well balanced or something that um, it's just, you know, it's right for me. So this is the one I got for Christmas. It has two compartments on the front. I usually keep one of my cell phones in there and then some hand sanitizer in one. It also came with a, with a long strap that I, I don't use. I just like to use it like this. It's got, uh, three zippers, one on each side. I emptied it out so I could show it easier. So it's got, you know, it's got a compartment here that, you know, you can, it's got two pockets right there and a zipper. And on the other side, it's got another compartment that's just simple. And also this right here, this zipper right here, there's a big pocket in there and that holds a whole lot too, as well as the two pockets. And you've got a third zipper that's in, a, in the middle where you can keep like your billfold and money and things like that because not only does it zip up, but these kind of go over it. So it's pretty hidden and pretty secure like that. So, um, you know, this is the Pippa Large Grab. I think it's what it's called. And uh, the good thing about it was Doug joined their mailing list. And so this purse went very, very deeply on sale. So he was able to get it at a fraction of what I had paid, uh, of what it would have cost and what we had paid for other purses. So I was just thrilled about that. Sometimes getting on a mailing list, you can get good deals like that. But, uh, you know, and it's got the, it's got the hardware on the, the little legs on the bottom because I'm, I'm bad about it working. I'm just setting it down on the floor. It's just got beautiful straps and hardware, and I'm just, uh, I just think it's absolutely beautiful. I think it's a gorgeous purse, and you can dress it up. I wear it with jeans, and I wear it with dresses to work. It's professional, and it just looks so pretty. I'm just really, really thrilled about it. And the thing that I'm thrilled the most is for all of you that had written to me that said, yes, I suffer from tennis elbow too. I guess my message is if you have are suffering from tennis elbow uh, and nothing seems to work, maybe look at your purse and see if maybe that is the right purse for you. Um, I know that the others were just not at all. And so when I went back to using a Pippa purse, that just, that solved the problem. And so my tennis elbow's gone. <laughs> so anyway, I did want to point that out in case other people were having such bad problems with their tennis elbow or their shoulder hurting or something like that to maybe think about looking at your purse because uh, also, the older we get, I think the things start like this start happening more too. I know it did with me. So thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it and have a wonderful, wonderful weekend. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.